How you going guys? It's Daniel from Stewart's Racing. Um, it's the 22nd, so tomorrow we're heading to Rosedale. Um, two cars. If you can see that one there. Not number eight, it's number six. Um, Shane's car is ready to rock and roll. It's been ready to go for a couple of weeks now. Um, we just, little bits and pieces. Um, been doing a little, little bit on mine. Uh, just a little bit of an update. I didn't give you anything last Sunday or Saturday. I like to sort of put something up every every week, but just busy with work and a bit tired on the weekend and as it is. So, um, not much different on mine from Swan Hill. Um, I have a co-pilot seat. So the other half's gonna jump in. Um, from Swan Hill, I got uh, my belts, we're out of date. So we've got a brand new set of belts in this, brand new set of belts in Shane's. And I had to put a hose clamp on my overflow hose that comes off the radiator. But to fix up the quarter, when I tried to get through a little gap against the wall in another car, and got sandwiched into the fence. Um, but this is pretty good to go. Um, did change the suspension a little bit. Just a little bit of an update. There's not much to do, so that's why I sort of didn't do any of it. Big shout out to all the sponsors: LV Corn Saw, Dragon Suspension Exhaust. Get onto this man here. Um, if you're a race car standards and stuff like that, and he really likes um, doing different stuff with speedway cars and stuff like that. LV Corn Saw to Darren. Um, just all in all, top bloke, helps us out. Um, he's been here tonight, just helping, doing little bits and pieces and everything like that. We got Victoria Rose Tea Rooms. Big shout out to them in Rosedale. If you're coming through tomorrow and you need to stop in and want to have some lunch or anything like that, they're the people to hit up. Um, just as you go past the first servo on the left, as you come in, they're down the main drag. Romlink Mall. Um, they do all our tin work, um, or any aluminium or anything like that. They do all our dashes and stuff like that. Uh, I put them in, but they f fab it all up. Highline race gear, race wear, sorry. High port heads. Um, this is not exactly a high port heads engine, but he freshened it up for me after we hurt some heads. Um, yeah, so big shout out. You know, me and Shane and Jack are going to hit Rosedale tomorrow. I don't know how the video is going to go. Um, just because I've usually got Jack or Shane filming. And probably no doubt Shane will be in a heat with me or whatnot. So it's going to be pretty hard. But, so. Then we've got this one over here. Shane's is all ready to rock and roll. Um, stick has come up really good. Except for one. We wanted that one a bit bigger. Um... Bit of miscommunication on both our parts, but absolutely happy. So industrial metal recycle is immoral. If anyone wants to get any scrap pit metal and everything, anything, um, yeah, recycled and get some cash for it, they're the people to see. The LV Core and Saw again, Stewart's Racing. And Rosedale Tea Rooms again. Rosedale Tea Rooms. They've sponsored me for, I think we worked out about eight years now, they've sponsored me. Um, last couple of years, with especially last year with COVID and everything like that, uh, they've looked after us with the old man passing and all that sort of stuff. Catering for our um, food and everything like that. So um, it, was, it was a must putting them on, on the cars again, especially they had so much to do with the old man. So... Um, as most of you, some of you know, that this cage here was one of the last ones my old man built with, with Shane. That's why this came up for sale, so we grabbed it. But the, she's all ready to go. Come up a treat, nice and clean. So yeah, we're heading off to, oh, shout out, here we go. Another quick car. Hey, can't go wrong with a quick car. Um, 
yeah, so off to Rosedale Speedway tomorrow. Um, we It's a Rosedale Classic. So, should be a good night. Rosedale always put on a good night. Um, just struggle a little bit with dirt. I love Rosedale, it's a good track. Just um, the, the dirt's not, not the best at the moment, but everyone's got a race on it, so it is what it is. Um, I struggle with it just as much as the 48 other competitors that are going to be there in our class tomorrow. So that's a big field for us. Um, we're going to do Delaware starts, uh, top six pole shuffle. Um, yeah, should be a good show. Should be a really good show. It'll be a late one, which I actually like a late one. Um, I like getting home, buggered and sore, not go racing and head home and think, what have you done? It's, I, I, I like that. That's me, but yeah. But no, that's all. So if you aren't doing anything tomorrow night, head. make sure you head down to Rosedale International Speedway at Rosedale. And that's our home club mining chains as well. So um, that's our prefix on our car. RD stands for Rosedale. So yeah, that's it, guys. Um, just a bit of an update on where we're at. Both cars are good to go. Shane will give this a wash. It's got a fair bit of dust on it. Um, and I just, uh, Shane just had to do a service on his today. Um, that 400k, 400,000k engine needed a service. A bit gunked up and all that sort of stuff. But eh, it'll be right. We'll just send it. No, that's all. It sounds pretty good too. Yeah, it is what it is. Um, yeah, big shout out to Jackie in his first race meeting tomorrow. The boy's nervous. He is very nervous, as you would be. But um, he is more nervous about disappointing people. But um, we've all started somewhere, and he, he just needs to look forward and eyes down and get the job done. Yeah. Alright guys, well, COVID at Rosedale is a little bit different. If you need to know any of the COVID plans, just hit up Rosedale Speedway. It's got a lot of info. Um, we won't possibly see you after the meeting. I don't think they're going to allow you in. I'm not 100% sure on that. Um, just the rules are the rules and that's, that's what they are. We just, yeah, like them or hate them. That's what it is. That's all guys. I'll upload this in the next half an hour just to give you a bit of an update. But yeah, both cars are good to go. Heading to Rosedale. Big shout out to all the sponsors. Um, can't thank you enough. See you next week. Oh, don't forget to like, subscribe and comment. And keep in touch on our Stuart's Racing and Fabrication Facebook. Because we put updates on that um, for the night of racing. So if you want to keep updated, that's where you want to go to. See you guys.